we're worried that if um, <clears throat> if we're beyond capacity, that we can't attend to the needs of kids. Dr. Hector Wong is the head of critical care at Cincinnati Children's Hospital. He warns kids are getting sicker from COVID-19. A year ago, we would have a handful of kids in the hospital who were with us for other conditions and happened to have COVID. Now what we're starting to see is kids in the hospital, including the ICU, who are there because of COVID. According to the Ohio Department of Health, in February, children up to 17 made up just 2.1% of COVID-19 cases. Fast forward to now, and they make up 30.2%. Children as old as four accounting for 3.4%, ages 5 to 10, 8.9%, ages 11 to 13, 7.5%, and ages 14 to 17, 10.4%. Now, six children's hospitals have signed this open letter from the Ohio Children's Hospital Hospital Association. We just don't know where this will go, and we want to ensure that we're able to take care of every kid that may need care at one of our institutions. Hospital Association President Nick Lashutka warns COVID-19 is affecting more kids while respiratory illnesses also spread. The letter also says more children have mental or behavioral issues. All of this is staffing is strained. That's why they are all asking people to get vaccinated, wear a mask, wash their hands, and socially distance. While we're able to handle the volumes we're seeing today, and we're not alarmist, uh, you know, the COVID numbers are still very modest in kids. We just don't know what next week, next month, uh, the month after that may mean. Now, Lashuka told me that in 14 years of doing this work, they have never penned a letter like this. He is telling people to get in touch with their doctors and pediatricians. We're live at Children's Hospital. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.